In the context of the uh, upcoming European Parliament election, obviously we understand that education is not a European competence, but the reality is that discussions and political debates in this election will reflect on national priorities. And we share right across the European Union a concern about the lack of finances in education. And we would expect to see our candidates then for the European Parliament have an understanding of the crisis that exists in education, particularly in higher education with regard to finances. So for instance, it always amuses me that um, we hear people talking about market forces. And these are often the people who are most critical of public expenditure. But they don't seem to recognize that the lack of finances for education is causing disincentives for people to come into their profession. So the teaching profession is suffering due to those disincentives. So we need to dedicate ourselves to the education agenda. And we need to understand that without teachers, there is no education. And without education, there is no prosperity. And when I say prosperity, I'm talking about financial prosperity, but also cultural prosperity. So whether it's in Ireland or right across Euro the European Union, education is an essential building block. And we would expect our candidates to address it in the course of the campaign.